Italian Terra plant, located in the Tver region, is one of the leading woodworking centers in Russia. It is the largest European producer of laminated veneer lumber, also called as LVL. There are several types of products that we can produce. One of those is reglued LVL manufactured using cold pressing technique that allows to produce beams with large cross sections. For these purposes, the facility was equipped with four production lines. At the cold pressing line, LVL billets are glued together flatwise. Then, press makes it possible to produce beams up to 1350 mm thick. That is, if the main production allows to produce LVL billets up to 100 mm thick, here we can glue larger structures measuring 600 up to 600 mm in cross section and up to 18 meters long. LVL is ideal for the constructions of large span structures ranging from 20 up to 40 meters. The workshop incorporates a production line to manufacture outsized and large span timber structures, such as those used for LVL based swimming pool or gym roofs. Deputy supervisor of the construction structures workshop. The frame is produced according to the special drawings and software uploaded into the machine. Interfaces to be connected are all marked. Then we see a pre-cut OSB layer being placed on top of the frame to be automatically nailed by the Optimate machine. LVL-based prefabricated houses production line produces already cut-to-fit house walls. In principle, this frame is assembled like Lego blocks, with specified parameters and precision. Further on, the solutions may vary. Some clad these buildings with metal, other with glass, that is, there can be any solutions and various forms. House frame interfaces are cut by the high-tech software equipment, which guarantees high precision of joints between the elements. Quality control is carried out at all production stages. It is a 100% guarantee that it will support them. These walls are of self-supporting type. That is, their behavior is stable under various weather conditions. LVL is treated with preservatives and fire retreats and then painted. The wood becomes fire and moisture resistant. LVL-based house frames are durable, rot and crack resistant and maintain their bearing capacity and geometrical stability under temperature or humidity fluctuations. The facility incorporates a design agency that will realize all the customer's desires in relation to a future home. We have some ready-to-use designs that we accommodate for production requirements and also those that should be done from the scratch, so to say. As per the customer's request, we can supply just a kit of parts to be assembled on a site on one's own. In the case, the difference is only in the assembly rate, that is, if the panels are cut to fit. The assembly rate is much faster, but if the house is supplied on a part-by-part -part basis, one can give a way to architecture change the location of partition walls to one's own liking. The assembly of such panels requires but two persons, even without machinery. You see the mineral wool isolation being laid in several layers depending on the panel thickness. Then per cut cover material is unstabled. Heat energy costs a mineral in alveol based prefabricated houses. The ambient air in the rooms is heated quickly, almost without cooling down. It's warm and dry inside the house. When we were building a sample house on the premises of the plant during the winter time, we were working in t-shirts only using nothing but heaters close by. That is, it has been tested on ourselves. A relatively low alveol density enables to build houses bearing lightly on the foundations almost on any ground type. For example, this house looks like a brick one. However, all the three floors are wholly built from LVL. We used frame and panel technology, that is the frame was assembled first to be then sheeted with OSB panels filled with the thermal and vapor isolating materials and clad with the decorative brick-style cement bounded particle boards. 
The house looks like a brick one on the outside. The experiment has proved to be a success. The future plans include the construction of several more houses using the preparatory patented technique. In 2014, our company built two three-story houses under the hazardous houses and orphans resettlement program. That is, these three-story houses were built according to our technique. There are 18 apartments in one house and 21 in the other. The hallmark of this technique is a high assembly rate. A three-story house can be built over a season within two or three months. The Ultra Dome technique allows to assemble alveol-based apartment houses within two or three months. The construction of prefabricated houses is a state-of-the-art technology enabling to construct comfortable, cozy and environmentally friendly dwellings for an affordable price.